what is up? Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my autograph collection. I have a bunch of autographs all in front of me here. Thought, why not start the first video of 2024 as a autograph collection. So these autographs are on my wall in my room and sometimes I'll just like switch them out once in a while so that I don't, I don't get bored of them. But I am already bored of them. Okay, I am. I need to get some more autographs. <laughs> like a pancake pile. <laughs> it doesn't have any fluff to it. What was that? Oh, it's my chain. I was like so the very first one I'm going to show you guys. I love this one so much. I mean, I waited all day to get a picture of this guy. So it was definitely worth the wait. It was worth every penny. I was so happy. Um, I was a huge fan of this TV show for eight years, and then I re then I just stopped watching it. Oh, so I got to meet Norman Reedus from The Walking Dead. He plays Daryl Dixon in The Walking Dead, and he was my all-time favorite character on The Walking Dead because he was badass. I met Norman Reedus in 2017, so eight years ago. I met my husband <laughs> guys I was fangirling so hard I didn't even know what to do you guys he was a wicked guy he was so cool so talkative he was even getting mad at the uh, security guards because they kept rushing everybody and he Norman was like can you stop rushing people please like I you know I'm, I want to take my time I want to talk to people autograph I was so excited when I got this I actually got this one in the BAM box because I used to get the BAM horror boxes I got an autograph and I got a prop which was signed so you guys will see <laughs> okay so this autograph I literally crapped everywhere and this is my all-time favorite Halloween movie out of all of the Halloween franchises that have ever came out this one is my go-to i've watched this one like a hundred times i got the girl that played jamie and then i got michael myers right there so i got my husband's hands and a bit of his face and then i got her i mean it would have been nice if like you know, I could see my husband's face a little bit over here instead of it just being like a corner of him and his hands. <laughs> Definitely hangs up in my bedroom too because I just, I just love it so much. I love this movie. So if you guys are wondering what Halloween movie I'm talking about, I am talking about the Halloween, The Curse of Michael Myers. So that's the one I am obsessed with. Right here, there's like a sticker there that proves that this is a real autograph. So if I were to sell it, then the person will know it's real. It's not fake. So I really appreciate BAM for doing that for us horror fans. So autograph is signed by this lady. She plays Jamie. I don't, I can't read handwriting. I think it says J.C. Brandy or something. I think it says that. I'm not too sure. The Jamie girl. I got a little bit of Michael and then I got Michael's knife that the guy signed. So I was so happy about that. I definitely scored when I got this box. Um, it just hangs up in my room like this. It, I left the plastic part on it just for protection because it, it just hangs up in my room. So um, this is just what it looks like. It's a big, obviously, butcher knife. Um, and then the guy that played Michael Myers in the Halloween, The Curse of Michael Myers. This is his signature. Other side of the knife, there is that little sticker proving that this is the real 
autograph of. Next autograph I'm going to show you guys is, I can't believe I actually got this autograph because when I was a kid, I was obsessed with this dude. I was like four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. I don't know how long that this show was out for, but who I'm talking about is the Tales of the Crypt. The Crypt dude. Me and my sister used to watch Tales of the Crypt Keeper all the time when we were kids. My brother was terrified of the Crypt Keeper. My brother would hear the music and he would a sticker on him too to prove that this is a real autograph. It says something Never mind. So, oh, I got the My Bloody Valentine autograph from the guy that played TJ. His name, name is Paul. What's his name? Paul Kelman is his real name. And this is just what it looks like. He signed it. And that's one of the girls that played in the movie with him. Actually wrote it to me. Um, so it says, To Amber with love, Paul Kelman. Love, a.k.a. TJ. So, dedicated to just me. This is such a amazing movie, My Bloody Valentine. Amazing. Who cares about the remakes? He was so nice to give me an extra photo signed by him. This is an awesome photo too. Well, the next autograph I'm going to show you guys is from the movie Sinister. I love the first one. I don't care about the other ones. The original one is the best. So happy to get Bagul. That's his name. He scared me the first time I ever seen Sinister the movie. He's so creepy. And then all the music they play throughout the movie it's even worse. <laughs> I have Bagul hung up in my bedroom. <laughs> so is Bagul's autograph. This girl from Insidious. I don't know her name or anything, but I remember her from Insidious. But you guys will probably remember her from insidious she's that lady that like stands up and like screams i think it's a pretty creepy autograph because she's creepy looking with it and then she signed her autograph right there in like silver pen or silver marker i should say so the next autograph that i'm going to show you guys is from silent night deadly night 2 and this is what it looks like. I actually seen this movie. It's pretty much about this guy here and he like snaps and he goes on like a killing spree around Christmas time. It's actually a really good movie. Like at first I thought it was going to be stupid, but it was actually decent and, and funny too. There's some funny parts in the movie too. So I'm going to say it's like a horror comedy <laughs> typical horror Christmas movie but honestly it is a really good movie put and the, and the actor put punish <laughs> and then put his name and the very last autograph that I'm going to show you guys is this one this is a werewolf dude this wolf of London is that what it's called he signed it So, I can't pronounce his, oh, I think it's, uh, I think it's David Nigel, David Nigel, I think that's what it says. It Anyways guys, I hope that you enjoyed this autograph collection and I thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching guys. Bye guys.